Question six. There's a picture of Alan in his greenhouse. And Alan's got 45 beans. He plants three beans in each of his pots. How many pots does he need? Well, we're not really interested in the picture there. So let's scroll down and get rid of that. That'll just distract us. So how many pots does he need? Well, he's grouping them into groups of threes. So we need to know how many groups of three there are in 45. So it's actually a divide question. It's going to be 45 divided by three. There's two ways we could do this. We could do a quick bush shelter division. So threes into 45. So threes into four goes once with one left over, the one left over carries to the next column to make 15. So now we say 3's into 15 goes 5 times with none left over, therefore we finish the question and the answer is up here at the top which is 15. So we would need 15 pots. We could just double check by making sure if we do 15 pots times by the 3 in each pot we get back to 45, three fives are 15, three ones are three, plus that one is four. So you would indeed, if you had 15 pots, and three in each pot would have 45 beans. So that does work. The other way we could have done this question would be to start with three, although this may take longer, three, then count up in threes, three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30, 33, 36, 39, 42, 45. So now we've got up in threes, we'll just count the pots. So that'll be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, lots of three, so 15 pots. This gives you the same answer here. Let's scroll down to see the second part of the question. Lila puts four seeds in each of her pots. She uses six pots and has one seed left over. How many seeds did she start with? Well, this one's nice and straightforward. So she's got six pots. And each of them has four seeds. So it's four multiplied by six. So four times by six equals 24 seeds. But she's got one seed left over. So she's got an extra one on top of that. So 24 plus one will give us 25 seeds. So she must have have started with 25 seeds. Just to double check, if she did start with 25 seeds, could she do six pots each with four? Well, six pots each with four would have been the 24 seeds, and then she would have had one left over, which she didn't put in the pot, so that would have made the 25 seeds. So that is correct. So your two answers are 15 pots and 25 seeds.